Hi, in this video, we're going to solve a particular problem which appeared in J Advanced 2022. So let's understand the problem first. So here we need we need to consider the only the principal values for the case of inverse trigonometric function. And we need to find the value of the given expression as you've seen in the screen. So let's go ahead and solve this particular problem in advanced level. So first, we consider the given expansion as given. So we consider that theta is equal to whatever given as follows. Now observe that between the cos term, cos inverse term, sine inverse and tan inverse term, the tan inverse term in looks very simple. So that's why we consider that alpha is equal to tan inverse root 2 by pi. Now, as we are talking about only the principal values, so therefore we can consider that tan alpha is equal to root 2 by pi and hence we can say that pi is equal to root 2 by cot alpha in other way, pi is equal to root 2 cot alpha. We consider that first term that is cos inverse of root 2 by uh, 2 by 2 plus pi square. That's it. So now here we have that pi is equal to root 2 cot alpha. So let's substitute that particular values. So therefore we get it as cos inverse of 2 divided by 2 plus 2 cot square alpha. So 2 to get cancelled and you get it as cos inverse of 1 by 1 plus cot square alpha. So therefore 1 plus cot square alpha will become cosec square alpha and that will gives me that cos inverse of 1 by cos alpha, 1 by cosec alpha and cosec 1 by cosec will be sine alpha. So therefore it will be cos inverse of sine alpha. Now see that sine alpha can be easily written as, as cos of pi by 2 minus alpha. Now, therefore, as we are talking about again, once again, the principal values, these values will be reduced to pi by 2 minus alpha. Now, let's go ahead. Consider the sine inverse term and in the same process as we could simplify the cos inverse term, we replace pi by pi by 2 minus pi equal to root 2 cot alpha. So, if we substitute that and we see that that in the denomin denominator we have 2 plus 2 cot square alpha and numerator we have again uh, uh, 4 cot alpha. So, therefore, 1 plus cot square alpha will become cosec square alpha and then we have uh, 4 cot alpha divided by cosec square alpha. Now, if I convert it into sine and cos respectively, we get it as sine inverse of 2 sine alpha cos alpha. We know that sine 2 sine alpha cos alpha is equal to sine 2 alpha. So, therefore, it will become sine inverse of sine 2 alpha. And again, once again, if we are, we are bothering about the principal value, so therefore, it will be 2 alpha. So, that we are able to obtain the three terms separately in the terms of alpha. So let's try to calculate or simplify values of theta now. So therefore theta is equal to 3 by 2 into pi by 2 minus alpha plus 1 by 4 into 2 alpha plus alpha. So if I multiply that, if we multiply that and add them together, we get it as 3 pi by 4 minus 3 alpha by 2 plus alpha by 2 plus alpha. So therefore, we can easily say that alpha plus alpha alpha by 2 will be 3 alpha by 2. That will be cancelled out by 3 alpha by 2 and hence theta will be 3 pi by alpha. So therefore, the simplified version or simplified value of 3 by 2 and cos inverse of something that given expression will be reduced to 3 pi by 4 and that's it and that's the answer. So if you are at the point in point of this J advanced solution, so then thank you and please subscribe to our channel to see more and more video JEPIQ problem. Stay with us, keep learning and put your valuable comment which help, help us to grow. Thank you.